Notre Dame is number one. Notre Dame with a miracle win is a He's going again. Notre Dame has scored. That was the first game that Joe really got quality time playing, and he was actually the third string quarterback at the time. A guy named Rusty Lish was our starting quarterback. Great athlete, great quarterback, but it just wasn't clicking for him. And uh, a backup to Rusty was a guy named Gary Forstack. Great quarterback, a senior teammate, classmate of ours uh, out of Michigan. Well, he went in. And he was really known for his passing. So we started the passing game and we started clicking and then he got a really nasty hit. And he was knocked out. And we kind of teased Joe Montana even to this day because Divine looked around and he like had no one left to put in but Joe Montana. And so he put in Joe and the rest is history. Dan Devine then made a call to his bullpen for the best reliever in college football, Miracle Man Joe Montana. Montana, in turn, look for Ken McAfee, the man he has learned to count on in clutch situations. You know, when you see a big target like that, it, and you know if you throw the ball anywhere near him, he's, he's going to come down with it. He's just got super hands and he runs super pattern. He's as big as the library. You can't miss him. I, I, but I do think of how Ken McAfee was our bread and butter tight end, you know, Montana to McAfee, whenever we needed a few yards, you know, we'd go, go to those guys. And, and then at the end of the day, the defense just stopped them. You know, the offense gave the defense a lot of energy. Just as he had done in 1975 against North Carolina and the Air Force, Montana guided the Irish back from an almost certain defeat. In those two comebacks and this fourth quarter rally, Montana accounted for 52 points, 19 of 26 passes for 417 yards, all in the span of only 15 and a half minutes. What I remember about Joe, the best thing about Joe Montana, see, yeah, he's a really talented uh, athlete, a great person, a, a teammate that we loved, but his competitive nature. You know, the great ones have that. Michael Jordan, Roger Staubach, you know, Colby Bryant. You just see how they love to compete. They hate to lose in anything. And that's what Joe's best trait was. So in that huddle, you know, we just knew that he had, he had the ability if we did our job. And that's all he said. He was a very low-key guy. He just thrived in that moment. Fullback Dave Mitchell fought his way into the end zone for the winning score against the Boilermakers. Montana was named UPI back of the week for his achievements. And though it was he who had inspired the Irish offense and turned the season around, he credited his teammates for the comeback. They responded very well. The receivers caught the ball, ran super patterns, and the line gave me every bit of time that I needed.